If you use taxi services often enough, you might know that taxi drivers have secrets they don't tell their passengers about. Let's figure out what things you should pay attention to while getting into a car, why you should always check the meter, and why it often takes taxi drivers so long to pick you up. Number 1. They may not have change, and is for a reason. Most modern taxis already have POSs, but there are still a lot of cars that don't. In these vehicles, people have to pay cash. If the driver says they don't have change, the passenger will have nothing to do but to leave them a larger tip. Ask your taxi driver if they have change in advance. Then you won't have to face an ultimatum at the end of your trip. 2. Ever been there before? This phrase is one big red flag. After you hear it, it might make sense to call for a new taxi. A person who drives for a living and uses GPS at that shouldn't ask you such questions. It can indicate that they want to take advantage of you. And if you answer, no, I don't know where it is, they may choose a longer route. 3. Airport taxi drivers charge tourists more. If an airport taxi driver assumes that you're a tourist, they may decide to give you a sightseeing tour you haven't asked for. Of course, it'll cost you way more than just a direct taxi ride to your destination. That's why, if you're indeed a tourist, Open GPS on your phone and ask the driver to take the fastest route possible. 4. A taxi driver may start a meter earlier. Some taxi drivers can start the meter not when you climb into their car, but as soon as they arrive to pick you up. Yep, it is against the rules. But if you don't pay attention to the meter that's already well on its way, you'll pay extra for the waiting time, which you aren't supposed to do unless it's more than 10 minutes. 5 they have a way to inform the police they're in trouble. Well, it might not work in all countries, but in some places, taxis have a panic button hidden under their dashboards. If a passenger is causing problems, the driver can press this button and a flashing yellow light will appear at the vehicle's front and rear ends and behind its grill. Some taxi drivers push this button when they feel their passenger isn't going to pay for the ride. 6. They love traffic jams. Ever heard about the popular taxi company's motto, the passenger's safety over the driver's speed? Well, there are taxi drivers who love to misinterpret this rule to earn some extra cash. They take it extremely slowly at the traffic lights and consider traffic jams their best friends. If you want to avoid getting stuck, provide your driver with exact directions. 7. A taxi driver can drop you off earlier than needed. If there are some obstacles preventing them from going directly to your destination, for example, heavy traffic or some construction works, some taxi drivers may leave you several blocks away. This way, they save their time and gas money. The only thing you can do in this situation is to send a complaint to the company they work for. 8. They can't start a conversation with you. According to this unwritten rule, The only person in the car who can start talking is you, the passenger. Then the driver can reply. If you feel tired of listening to the taxi driver's life stories, you can politely interrupt them. On the other hand, if you're new to the neighborhood, it may be useful to ask your driver for some recommendations, like what places to visit and where to eat. 9. You can find yourself stranded. If you need to make several stops before arriving at your final destination, discuss it with your driver. Tell them exactly for how long you're going to be absent and don't stay inside for longer than the agreed time. Taxi drivers need to earn their living and they can't wait for you for hours. A new customer may come along and you'll be left stranded before reaching your final destination. 10. Check the meter. Before starting your trip, make sure that the meter has the correct settings. Taxi companies can have different prices for certain parts of the day and night. If your driver puts a wrong type of ride in the system, the bill can turn out much higher than expected. 11. Keep track of the meter. You should not only sneak a peek at the meter at the beginning of your trip, but also watch it throughout the ride. Taxi drivers always watch passengers in the back. If they notice you aren't paying attention, the most dishonest ones can try to give you a larger bill. Check the meter several times throughout your trip. This way, you'll notice if the sum has suddenly increased. When you arrive at your destination, make sure that the numbers in your bill and on the meter match. 
12. Check your valuables before leaving a taxi. Don't let your valuables lie around during a taxi trip. Before leaving the car, make sure you haven't left anything on the seat. Most taxi drivers go to great lengths to deliver forgotten items to their owners. And while doing it, they waste their time and gas. So if it happens to you, remember to tip your driver. Others just leave forgotten stuff at their company, and you can get it back by calling the lost and found number. But a tiny percentage of taxi drivers may keep your things, and you'll never prove that you left them in the car. 13. Taxi drivers can lure you with a low estimate. It's totally dishonest, but there are taxi drivers who tell you an estimate they know to be too low only to make you pick their car. Then, at the end of your ride, you're in for a nasty surprise. Unfortunately, there's no sure way to find out if the estimate is true, and you're usually at the mercy of your taxi driver. 14. Ask for a fixed price in advance. A fixed price often turns out higher than it would be with a meter. One of the few valid reasons for negotiating a fixed price is being short on cash. In this case, if you know the price in advance, you won't have to spend the whole ride anxious about whether you have enough money to cover the bill. 15. Taxi drivers can manipulate GPS settings. It allows them to take longer routes and earn more money. The only thing you can do is to check the route you're taking on your device and discuss the road choice with the driver. Who knows? Maybe they're taking a longer way for a reason. 16. A taxi driver may not have a license. It rarely happens these days, but it does. Keep in mind that a taxi driver has to have their license displayed inside the car at all times. If you can't see it, don't be afraid to ask. If you find out that your driver doesn't have a license, leave the car and inform the police. Whatever reason for driving without a license they may have, it's still unacceptable. 17. Why taxi drivers take a while before picking you up You call a taxi, and it takes the driver way longer than the estimated time to arrive. Been there, seen that. (laughs) What most passengers don't know, though, is that many taxi drivers pick up a new ride before finishing their current one, or they just take their sweet time running some errands. 18. They can charge per person. Even though it's almost unheard of in most parts of the world, some taxi drivers can try to charge per person. Watch out for such cases and call the taxi company to make sure you aren't being fooled. The only way it can be legitimate is when you've ordered a van for more than four people. Even then, only the number of people above four is charged. Finally, be aware that when you're flying, the airline cannot charge you to taxi on the runway. Just thought you should know. Hey, if you learned something new today, then give the video a like and share it with a friend. And here are some other videos I think you'll enjoy. Just click to the left or right, and remember, stay on the bright side of life!